Soledad, honey, where are you going? I'm going to swim a while, Mother. I'll be back soon. Soledad, please don't. You know we're employees here, and we're not allowed to use the facilities on the oh, boat. Oh, Mother, please. You're going to get me in trouble with the captain. I won't stay too long. Don't oh. worry, I'll be right back. Don't say that I didn't warn you. Here. Get the cases of champagne and put them down in the cellar, and you, Sabas, put the car away when he's done. What's wrong with you? Seems like this is a big party. Listen, Bernarda, in case you've forgotten, we're talking about my father's marriage. It doesn't happen every day. Rinaldi, you've got some mail. Where is Here you go. By the swimming pool having breakfast. Good morning, Father. You didn't sleep here last night, did you? No, of course not. That's why you haven't heard about this. Now find out for yourself. service. Young lady, if you don't mind me saying so, you're a great swimmer. <laughs> well, maybe it's the practice. I swim quite often. Mm, well, I can see that. <laughs> it's a pleasure. Alejandro Asiniegas. How do you do? Excuse me. Would it bother you if I asked you to have supper with me tonight? Um, well, it's just that tonight is the captain's dinner, isn't it? That's why I'm asking. I'd like you to join me. What do you think? I'll see you there, all right? Wait a second. Wait a second, what's your name? Who's that? She's really beautiful, isn't she, man? Mm. <laughs> She's going to have dinner with me tonight. <laughs> <laughs> shipment was worth millions. It has to be that somebody betrayed you, Father. I asked you to take care of this situation personally. But I'm sure you were lying somewhere with one of those sluts. Isn't that so? In any case, I'm going to find nothing. out... Nothing. You'll do absolutely Father. nothing. From this moment on, this family will be low profile. Sabas! Sabas! How can I help you, sir? To the airport. My wife's plane should be landing right now. And you, Ronaldo. Let's see if you can manage to gather the whole family here to welcome my new wife this evening. The entire family. You understand me? Yes, Father. Get me out of here! Bernarda, for God's sake, take care of the lunatic. My friend, this is really a beautiful place, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Gentlemen, how are you doing today? We're great. Follow me, please. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. Hey, Alejandro, let's see if I understood you. You say you're gonna have dinner tonight with a woman, but you don't even know her name? That's right, brother. But that doesn't matter. What matters is that she's a stunningly beautiful woman. <laughs> it's really nice to hear you talking so enthusiastically about a woman. There you go, gentlemen. 
Let's hope you fall in love and finally get married. It's time you stop playing the grieving widower. Hey, hey, man, don't exaggerate, huh? I would love to spend a nice romantic weekend with that woman on this ship, but that's all. Don't mention marriage, and don't forget that I said I would only get married once. Yes, but they also say that marriage is like a freight train that you just can't stop. <laughs> Joko, I would like the pasta al dente. Al dente. Al dente. Do you know what I mean? Yes. Al dente. Al dente. Thank you. <laughs> Honey, you shut up late yet again. No, I'm not late, mother. But I come mean, on now, Soledad, what do you think? That you're here as a tourist? This is your job, honey. But wait a minute, Mother. It isn't even my shift yet. I'll be on duty when we get to the island. We haven't even arrived oh, yet. Oh, well, I didn't know that since you never tell me anything. Listen, the captain gave us three days so that we can stay in Miami. You know, your grandma's not too well. I don't know. I'm really worried about your grandmother's health. Hmm. Soledad, get ready now. In ten minutes, we're going to disembark the passengers. Okay. Come on, Thank you. Honey. You know something, Mother? What? I'm getting fed up with this job. Oh, so the dad. Let me out of here. You are the devil. You're the devil. I hate you so much. Come down, Lucia. Don't make me get rough with you. I have to get out of here. You must understand. I have to find my son. Oh, please, Rodrigo, take my son from me. No. He's right here, Lucia. Look at him. He's right here. You're a bad mother. You're throwing him on the floor. My beautiful son. That isn't my son. My son was always laughing. He used to laugh. <laughs> my son used to cry. And I used to hold him in my arms and he would fall asleep. He used to sleep in my arms. Why did they take him away? Why did they take away my son? Why did they take away my son? <laughs> Rodrigo took away my son. Rodrigo, yes. He took him away. Oh, Rodrigo, please give me my son back. Oh, please. Rodrigo. 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 <laughs> 